a Wikividi Documentaries production. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Enjoy. Edward Drummond Edward Drummond was a British civil servant, and was personal secretary to several British prime ministers. He was fatally shot by Daniel Mnitton, whose subsequent trial gave rise to the Mnitton rules, the legal toast of insanity used in many common law jurisdictions. Drummond was a scion of the family who owned and ran Drummond's bank. He was the second son of Charles Drummond, a banker, and his wife, Frances Dorothy. He joined the civil service in June 1814, becoming a clerk at the Treasury. He was private secretary to a succession of British prime ministers, George Canning, Lord Godrich, the first Duke of Wellington, and Robert Peel. On 20 January 1843, while serving as personal secretary to Peel, he was shot by Daniel Mnitton, who had developed delusions about the Tory government. Drummond emerged from Peel's house in Whitehall Gardens at about 4 p.m., and set off to walk to his apartment in Downing Street. Mnitton mistook him for Peel and shot him in the back. The bullet passed through his chest and diaphragm, lodging in his abdomen. The bullet was removed later that day, but despite medical treatment, Drummond died five days later, at Charlton, near Woolwich, and was buried in the vaults of St. Luke's Church, Charlton, on 31 January. Mnitton was later tried for murder, but found not guilty, by reason of insanity. The Mnitton rules developed by the House of Lords after his trial were to establish the basis for the insanity defense in all common law countries. In popular culture, Drummond features as a character in season 2 of the ITV television series Victoria. He is portrayed as being significantly younger than he was in the 1840s, and the year and circumstances of his assassination are significantly altered. He is also shown as having a relationship with Lord Alfred Paget, which is generally regarded as being improbable. In the episode, Drummond is killed instantly, when he throws himself in front of an assassin's bullet to protect Peel immediately after the vote to repeal the Corn Laws. Brought to you by Wikividi Documentaries Would you like to know more?